Testing, testing. Hi, my name is Efraim Balderas. This is Charles from Sydney. My name is Ahmed Khaled. Hi, my name is Becky Robinson. Hi everyone, my name is Matt. I live in Cardedeu, it's a small village near Barcelona. I live in a small town in the UK called Chroma. I am from Ireland. I live in Fremont, Nebraska, in the United States of America. Hi, this is Abhishek from Srinagar, Uttarakhand, India. I'm Luis from Spain. Physician from Italy, very close to retirement. And I'm from Mexico City. I live in Jakarta, Indonesia. I'm from Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic. Greetings from the far north of New Zealand. This is a recording for Thinking 101. I am not comfortable with my face or my voice on a video. Because I strongly believe that people, the more informed they are, the better choices they're going to make. I decided to look at the social pressures in the college environment. People's belief in Chinese medicine's effectiveness. How we construct our organizations has tremendous impact on our integrity. Some of my beliefs were poppycock. How do we know that we aren't actually being influenced by an availability heuristic or being influenced by confirmation bias? Oh, Hannes, you should stretch before you skate. I have learned an incredible number of tools to improve everyday thinking from this course, the science of everyday thinking. My take on changing the world is changing myself. I believe that I indeed changed the opinion of this group of 22 young men. I will tell my students, I will teach my students different ways in which they can improve their learning. I want my life to be influenced and influence other people. The project I'm going to take on uh, with uh, Think 101 would be something about planning and getting things done. Why do gamblers think that playing a poker machine more increases their chances of winning? In order to bring the peace needed to progress on to all those many other solvable problems that are occupying and capturing our very existence. If you can take just one moment to stop and critically evaluate the information presented to you, use System 2 and not System 1. You really have the power to change the world. I'm gonna try and to change the world a little bit by teaching children on a nearby foster care shelter about episode five, learning to learn. I might not be able to change the entire world, but I can certainly change my world. I've shared the knowledge I've gained over the past weeks with my family and we are starting to think more like scientists. To work together with a very special group of students who are very keen to set up a club on campus that will promote scientific literacy. I'm going to do some lessons with high school students showing them that if they don't vote, someone else is making the decisions for them. So you have many opportunities to do it, to invite people to be a skeptical, to ask questions. Succinic acid, which is the element released from the amber, um, has a melting point of 187 degrees Celsius. Um, and since body temperature is only 37 degrees Celsius, there's no way that the acid could be released I wish everyone success in our attempts to change the world for the better. I think we all owe it to ourselves to slow down, consider the evidence, think clearly, and together we may just be able to change the world.